Hello and welcome to our reflection for today. Uh, and it's on Psalm 91. Psalm 91 is an assurance of God's protection and all people can come to the Lord seeking refuge and safety. In this psalm we find hope of a way forward and a way to peace. We read many words here that assure us of a safe place in God. He shelters and we are offered to come and live under the shadow of the Almighty. Verse 15, I hope, will be a great source of comfort that when people call God, uh, will answer and be with them, and he will rescue them. This psalm reminds us of God's protection throughout our lives, in good and bad times, and that we are able to turn to him in all circumstances. And he is there for us. There is also a recognition of the wholeness of a person, a physical, social, mental and spiritual well-being for all people who call on him. However, this does not separate safety from injustice. And it is important to seek justice for those who are in need of justice. And we can bring to mind many in our world in need of justice and mercy. Verse 15 ends with the assurance that God will honour his people and this would hopefully bring restoration, or at least the beginning of restoration. And so I ask, to whom do you turn in times of trouble? Are you able to help others turn to God? Where are the places of refuge and shelter for those in need in your community? As we ponder on these questions, I'm going to read Psalm 91 for us. You who live in the shelter of the Most High, who abide in the shadow of the Almighty, will say to the Lord, My refuge and my fortress, my God in whom I trust. For he will deliver you from the snare of the fowler and from the deadly pestilence. He will cover you with his pinions and under his wings you will find refuge. His faithfulness is a shield and buckler. You will not fear the terror of the night, or the arrow that flies by day, or the pestilence that stalks in darkness, or the destruction that wastes at noonday. A thousand may fall at your side, ten thousand at your right hand, but it will not come near you. You will only look with your eyes and see the punishment of the wicked. Because you have made the Lord your refuge, the most high your dwelling place, no evil shall befall you, no scourge come near your tent. For he will command his angels concerning you to guard you in all your ways. On their hands they will bear you up, so that you will not dash your foot against a stone. You will tread on the lion and the adder, the young lion and the serpent you will trample underfoot. Those who love me, I will deliver. I will protect those who know my name. When they call to me, I will answer them. I will be with them in trouble. I will rescue them and honour them. With long life, I will satisfy them and show them my salvation. May you reflect on those words of that psalm as you go through the week. And I pray that the Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. Amen.